hello guys welcome to another video in this video we will learn how we can create this uh, tab layout uh, with view pager 2 and uh, as you can see our tab layout is horizontal we will learn how we can create this uh, tab layout let's start the video okay first of all I want to create new project this empty activity click next project name tab layout with view pager 2 first of all I want to create our fragments for do this I want to create uh, one more package this package name will be fragments and inside this package uh, we can start uh, to create our blank fragments uh, this blank fragment name will be first fragments we don't need the, uh, all this code we can delete and uh, and let's create another second fragment second fragment will be blank fragments and also we can delete this code and yes uh, as you can see our fragments are ready and now uh, we want to keep going uh, to add some code uh, inside activity main and I want to change this uh, main layout not constraint layout it will be linear layout and uh, we add to orientation inside this linear layout orientation vertical because we need uh, two things tab layout and view pager and tab layout mesh parents wrap content and of course we have to add some id And this code is too much important. Uh, if you want to, uh, your top, uh, your tab layout will be uh, scrollable. Uh, you have to add this uh, tab mode. This is the important point. And we pager to match parents, match parents, and ID. We pager and we can close this tag and I want to add Kotlin extensions for uh, for get uh, components ID and ok our fragments are ready our activity main are, uh, is also ready and uh, we have to connect this tab layout and view pager uh, for do this we uh, need to one adapter and this adapter extends fragments state adapter and also we if to we need to get some uh, parameters fragments manager and also life cycle and we can write inside this fragment state adapter uh, our parameters and life cycle as you can see we have one error uh, if you click this lambda and implement implement member we have to add two uh, members inside this class 
and inside that give this get item count uh, function as you can see we have uh, six fragments and and inside this create fragments we will write return while position this is a uh, this is our zero position in zero position we want to show first fragments zero this is our first first position second fragments and yes our adapter is ready and uh, we can go to the main activity main activity we have to de uh, define uh, our adapter we pager adapter support fragment adapter and life cycle and uh, and now we have to connect uh, our repager uh, adapter equals to this adapter for the this repager dot adapter equals to adapter and now we have to write uh, we can use this tab layout editor and inside the this tab layout editor uh, we have two parameters first parameter uh, tab layout and second parameter view pager tab and position and we will use when for get position in position 0 tab dot text equals to first in position 1 tab dot uh, text equals to second and that's attach and okay our uh, activity main also ready and now I want to change uh, fragments uh, UI I want to change this uh, frame layout not frame layout but it's layout and text will be first and take size uh, 26 X SP and center parent true and of course this will be not match parents for app content for app content and okay this is our first fragments first fragments uh, first fragments UI we can copy this uh, text view and we can paste in the second fragments relative layout of course not first seconds and yes our uh, fragments you are also ready and now we can test our application click play And of course we have an error and I know this error, don't worry. Let's uh, start over. yes this is our application uh, you can see uh, this is our tab layout and this area our uh, view pager and inside the tab layout you can see our tab layout uh, is horizontal I mean scrollable 
Okay guys, thanks for watching. I will share uh, source code uh, in description. You can use of course uh, this project in your pro uh, inside your projects. Thanks for watching.